second grade. I am so excited for this next part of our rock unit. I'm so excited. You're gonna love it. It is so awesome. Okay, so I went through all of our rocks at school and I am trusting you with nice rocks that we have at school, but I need to have them all back in September. So our job is to take really good care of them, but with a twist. Here is a rock and it looks kind of like, uh -uh, I'm a rock, okay? You can add a costume to your rock. You can give them a cool name like Dwayne the Rock Johnson or Rocky Balboa or Sandy or I don't know. I know you'll come up with a great rock name. And you're gonna, you're gonna be taking such good care of your rock. Now, I have a couple rules. The rocks don't get any tattoos. So you cannot draw on these rocks, okay? You can decorate them, you can give them a costume, but they do not get anything that is drawn on or permanent. That's key. Because um, Country Day is trusting you as second graders to have some of their property to use when this over this time when we're at home. So um, having said that, you need to be responsible for it. But this is the next great part of this project. You could make a pouch for it. You could make a little pocket. You could make a sling. You could take the rock with you when you go on a bike ride. You could take the rock outside. You could make it a swing set. You could make the rock a swing set. You could make the rock a fort. You could take it on virtual field trips. I'm gonna give you some of those virtual field trips that have to do with rocks, and you can take your rock there. You can send me a postcard from the virtual field trip that you made. You can design a postcard that says, Visiting Ayers Rock in Australia. It was so cool. Can't wait to see you in the fall, Mrs. Matthews. Love, Ava. Okay? Couple things with this. There are so many cool things that you're going to be able to do with this rock. Like I said, you could make it a fort. You could make it a platform. You could um, make it so that it was in a pulley and you could make a pulley so that it went up and down. But your rock, you're going to design adventures for it. Okay, so your adventures could be in your neighborhood, they could be in your backyard, they could be in your kitchen, but you are designing adventures for your rock. So you can give it a cool name, you can dress it up in a costume, I'm going to send you some virtual places where you can actually go. Like I said, you could make a pamphlet about it, but there's going to be so many things that you can do for this rock. I think it's going to be so much fun. And the fun thing is, oh, this is the other thing. You have to tell your friends, if they are not on Seesaw, get on Seesaw so that we can see everybody else's rock adventure, okay? So, like, if you are like, oh, I am going to, uh, I am going to Stonehenge with my rock, then you can put that picture on Seesaw and everybody can see your adventure. That way I'd be like, oh, that's so cool. This kid went to Stonehenge and this kid went to Mount Rushmore. This kid did something totally different but everybody can see it if you put it on Seesaw. So to your friends that are not on Seesaw right now, you need to say, hey you guys, get on Seesaw. It's gonna be so cool. And we're gonna share in, in, in each other's adventures.